Hello friends, I'm Parways and this is our 12th video in QD5 C++ GUI application development. In the previous video, we have learned how you can create list widgets in QD5. Uh, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can create uh, message boxes in QD5. So now I'm going to create a new uh, project, a new file of project, QD widget application. And I'm going to uh, give it let me choose a... okay now I'm going to give it a name Q message box click on next next I'm going to choose a Q dialog next and finish okay Uh, there are different kind of message box that you can use in QD5, for example, uh, information message box, about message box, warning message box, question message box. Uh, let me add some push buttons in here. Uh, this is my uh, project, uh, my header files and my source files and also my UI file. Let me add push button in here uh, for push button. like this and just uh, choose this and like this let me make it smaller uh, and make it uh, layout vertically okay. change this uh, the first one is information information box uh, this is warning box about box and question box like this okay now click on this and go to slot uh, clicked okay uh, for this for the information uh, you can simply write first you need to import Q message box let me import this in dialog.h Q message box now in CPP uh, Q message box information now it needs some parameters the first one is parent I am going to give it this and the second one is the title uh, information box and the third one is the, the third one is the uh, string that you want to give. For example, I'm I'm going to give this as the text. Okay. Uh, let me run this and let me open my dialog.ui. This was information box. Let me click on warning box. Uh, go to slot. Clicked. Okay. Now for this you can simply write uh, Q message box and uh, warning. Also it needs some parameters. The first one is parent. It is this. Uh, the second one is title. Uh, warning box. And the third one is the text. This is warning box. Okay, now my completed, let me click on information box. You can see this is the text information. Uh, okay, our warning is completed. Let me complete all of this and about box. Good slot, I uh, clicked. Now for this, I'm going to give it Q message box about parent no, not parent sorry this uh, about box this is about box okay now this is completed and my for message box a uh, good slot I uh, clicked message box 
Okay, it was for my question box, not message box. Okay. Uh, Dialog.cpp. Question. Okay, the first one is this. And the second one is the title. I'm going to give it question. Question box. And, uh, and the third one is, for example, I'm going to I'm going to write uh, do you like sport and the third one is uh, the fourth one is you can give uh, for example uh, some custom buttons and let me in here you can simply write Q message box yes or Q message box no okay now let me run this and my four message box completed also there are some other message box that you can use but these are the popular ones that we can use now it's building uh, okay now it's completed first i'm going to click on information box uh, warning box this is warning you can see we have an icon uh, about box and question box you can see we have uh, do you like sport yes or no uh, thank you guys if you have any question please let me know and for the further videos please subscribe to my channel